Hi, I'm Matt. I've worked at the RAC now for 15 years. Today I'm going to talk to you about maintenance on your electric vehicle. The main concern as far as maintaining an electric vehicle is the high voltage battery. With roughly 100,000 to 150,000 moles of usage per battery, this needs monitoring at each service to make sure you aren't caught short on a long journey. Your electric vehicle can be charged from your home plug socket. We'd always advise that you do this overnight as it can take six to eight hours to complete. You can purchase separately a home charger unit and this can charge as fast as an industrial one. An industrial unit or a public charger can charge your car within three to four hours. There are also public charging points. These are usually located at motorway service stations, petrol stations and supermarkets. There's two types of chargers available. There's a slow charger which can charge the battery up within three to four hours or you have a DC fast charge. This can charge the battery up to 80% within 30 minutes. Public charging points require a card to activate them. There are many different types of cards for different types of charging stations, so it's always worth checking you have the right card for the right station. Some charging stations use a smartphone app to activate. It's always worth checking what stations use what app. Now there can be a subscription fee for this or a one-off charge, and this can be anywhere between three and eight pounds. There are different types of charging leads, similar to there being different types of cards for different charging stations. Now there can be seven different types of charging cables, so it's always worth checking before you make that journey that you've got the right one that fits your car. There's a number of ways you can preserve your battery life for longer. Minimise the use of DC charging. Even though this is convenient, prolonged use can damage the high voltage battery. Don't park the vehicle in extremely hot or cold conditions without the vehicle being on charge. This can trigger the cooling or the heating system on the car, causing the battery to go flat. Use the cruise control system when possible, as maintaining a constant speed uses less energy from the battery. Also, consider coasting up to junctions. Research the driving modes on your vehicle, as you'll be able to extend your range by choosing the right one for the journey you're going on. Consider the eco mode for when going on longer journeys. There are over 12,000 charging points in the UK. With the right preparation, you should never get caught short. From the outside, an electric vehicle is very similar from a standard car. Although this vehicle doesn't require engine oil, the brake pads and brake fluid will require checking and replaced when necessary. The tyres need to be frequently checked for wear and replaced roughly every 25,000 miles. The windscreen wipers need to be replaced every six months to a year. Carry out regular checks on the vehicle lighting system make sure all bulbs are operating correctly. If you do find a fault, refer back to your authorised repairer as LEDs can't be replaced by the customer.